Alright, what's up YouTube? An update on the router we tried to fix or was fixing. I really give some massage on the Apex Zip groups. These are the tools I use. This one, this one here. And those little ones there. So this is what we need. Remember I told you guys all we need is some movement. That's what we need. It's a little bouncing. That's how it's supposed to be. So that's one of the phases. So now let's move to the other ones. Here's the other phase. You see, that's the movement we need and we want. It has to bounce. Let's try the other phase now. It will be asking how is it a bouncing. So this is why, because I have the Spring, let me get it up. This is amazing. Let's look at the other face. This is a damaged one. The spring in there. It picks you there. There, see the free movement, free bouncing. That's all we need. Cause remember the apex is the one that does the the compression. Oh, I lost the edge, but yeah. So you just can see the bouncing and then the movement. Spring move, move it around there. There you go. So there you guys have it. This rotor is ready to install. If you want to check your edges and anyone, if it's damaged or not, you're going to grab your Apex seal. Use our new. You put them in here. Go side by side. It's clean. Side by side. Clean. Side by side. Clean. So let me show you how it looks after a uh, little bit of massage. A little bit of everything. Go ahead the groove in there. To the groove in there. As you guys can see, it has free play, has free movement, and it's free to go. See, side by side. I'll go in it. If I drop the apex on there, it will go in like nothing. See, there. And yeah, not, no problem. It goes slow again. There you go. There you guys have it. This one's ready to go. You have the old control rings. The oil control rings. The bearing is clean. So we're good. And then if any one of you is looking to find which if they have the rear front and what the weight, it's gonna have the letters in here. Come on, focus. There you go. R rear. The weight is a D. Rear weight D. Thanks for watching.